What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Rich Nice back once again. So today we got a new vehicle for the channel that y'all start to see. Uh, we got a couple of mods coming in the near future for it. Um, this vehicle you've seen on the channel before. I uh, reviewed it a couple of years ago. It belongs to my son or it did. Uh, since then he's upgraded by the uh, BMW 340 M340i. So what I'll do is I'll link that in the description. Uh, just in case y'all want to go check out his new ride uh, And without further ado, I'll show you what's inside the garage that we're adding to the channel So this is an Audi S3 2015 um it's running 19 inch tires factory it has lord coil over suspension on it it has dark tinted windows uh two tens in the trunk uh scar it has a scar um 2000 watt amp It has a couple of other goodies. So what I'll do is uh, I'll put the review that I did a couple years ago. Uh, we'll start that and I'll show you uh, the insides and all the stuff that's been done to it uh, since he's had it. And then we'll go from there. But again, this is a new vehicle for the channel. You'll get to see it again uh, as we do some more stuff to it. Um, Believe it or not, it's pretty quick to be uh, a four-cylinder, and it's all-wheel drive. So without further ado, roll that beautiful beam footage. What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy back once again, Rich Nice. As I promised, uh, we're going to go over the S3 today. I'll show you all the mods and everything my son done to his car. Um, thank God he'll be back next week, so I ain't got to take care of it no more. Uh, so we'll go from here. It's a 2015 Audi S3. As you can see. Alright, some of the mods that it has. As a CTS intercooler, which is right down there. Not sure if y'all can see that. Uh, three and a half inch downpipe, which is right there. He has the old CTS cold air intake. There's a CTS blow off valve. I know it's tucked down in there somewhere. <clears throat> he has a CTS catch can, which is right here. He has an ESC upgraded springs, which is why it sits so low to the ground, front and rear. And it's also been tuned by uh, United Motorsports. It has 401 rear wheel horsepower, 379 foot pounds of torque. And it's making right around 27 PSI out of a four cylinder all wheel drive. That's basically a quick run around of the car. See underneath his hood, all his little stickers and stuff. TTS turbo. The turbo's also been upgraded, which you really can't tell, but it's right back there. Um, like I say, it's a very nice car. For somebody that's 27 years old, he has the uh, carbon fiber spoiler in the back.
He also has his little toe pin. You wouldn't understand. He also has the carbon fiber front splitter. So let's take a look on the inside. Oh. Let me turn this down for YouTube ban me. So he has uh all the bells and whistles in it, sunroof, leather, heated seats. He has nav. Look down here, it'll tell you all the good bells and whistles. You hit the up, there's his nav. Down for your telephone. Hit this one up, there's your radio. Hit it one more time. There's your FM. Your AM back to your series, you hit down. Is your Bluetooth, your volume control, parking brake, push start. Then you have all your buttons where you can zoom in on the map. So uh, what we're going to do is, since I ain't started this car in over a week and a half, we're going to take it around the block real quick. I'll give y'all a little test ride. Oh yeah, I can hit that turbo. And I must tell you, this thing is super quick. For a car that weighs right around 3,000 pounds, maybe a little more, maybe a little less. With uh, all wheel drive, 401 horsepower. Yes, sir, all day long. Boost for days. She is definitely ready. And by the way, this car is named Selena. And she sits low and pretty. He might be up to selling it because he wants to start a new project. So if you uh, PM us, serious inquiries only, uh, he might want to sell it. You never know. Because a lot of other products out there that we can get into. So uh, until next time, one love. Uh, next video coming up will more than likely be beast mode. Now this can't run with beast mode. It'll give it a good try if we got the black key. And I'll explain all that in the next video. Once again, to all my new subscribers, because there was uh, two or three of y'all that uh, subscribed. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. All my other subscribers that's been with me from day one. I thank you so much. Please stay around. Please pass it on. Please like, subscribe, hit the bell so when I load up Beast Mode, you'll know when it is. And we'll go from there. Until next time, one love. Peace.